Uh, it feels great. You know, I'm glad to help the team. You know, it's really, it's really nice to get three points. I think mean, we, we really needed that. You know, we're always good at home, so it's just great that I could uh, contribute to that. Obviously, it's kind of been a tough run for the team, especially you know going down, uh, getting that goal, and then having Dave be able to come back mm -hmm. and uh, score. Just what does it mean? Is it something that you can kind of build off? You know, heading into the playoffs. Oh, it's great. It's a great team effort. You know, Dave getting that goal is great. Like, it's great for him as well. You know, getting his first goal. And the MLS, I think, yeah, so the MLS, he scored in the Open Cup, that doesn't matter. Uh, but it's great, you know, it really shows the spirit of the team, you know. We've gone through some hard times recently, but, you know, we're still together and a collective. I guess just on your goal, um, you guys have been playing kind of a new system. It seems like you kind of have a little more freedom to kind of get mm -hmm. forward, especially down the left. Is that kind of what resulted on that? Yeah, you know, I think I think I made a run behind. And I sort of looped around and found, found a nice little pocket. It was, it was a great pass from Mark. You know, brilliant disguise pass, and well, obviously I got the finish. Yeah. I ask almost four. I was gonna say almost forty thousand in the stands tonight. But there's a little cold there in the game today. You start to get a little bit of that kind of playoff vibe from tonight's game. Oh, completely. You know, the fans were fantastic. You know, it's always great to see, and you can see it coming in. You know, a few couple people were late because so many people getting in there. But you know, it's great to hear uh, hear the fans, and it's great for them to sort of push us on when we're going through a little bit of a rut. I asked Clint uh, if you're a little bit more confident after the experience with the England U19 team. He said that you've always been a confident player. Uh, can you just talk about that experience and how that's been in your development? You know, it's been a great experience. You know, it's it's always going to be difficult. You know, new experience and that. But you know, I think. Especially at, at my young age, I really got to try to experience everything and learn as much as I can. And obviously, you know, you have quite a relationship with Clint, you know, spending some time with yeah. Rebs too. It was his first win tonight. Just what does it mean to kind of play a part in that and getting him his first win? You know, I really, uh, I really respect him as a, as a person and a coach. You know, I think he's, he's um, a respectable guy, you know. He knows what he's talking about and I think what he's trying to implement is, is pretty, uh, pretty good. And, you know, we just got to... We just gotta keep winning. Um, you mentioned you mentioned Mark Anthony um, with the assist on your goal. I guess he seems like you know he's a defensive midfielder, but he also can kind of pick out a pass. I guess just what is that uh, in terms of his game? I guess when you guys have the ball, you know, it's really important to have players that can play forward and really break lines, and he certainly did that today. How big of a moment does it feel if the team are able to get home field advantage to to know that opposition teams know that coming here is a really difficult place to get results? Uh, it's vital, you know. We have the fans, we have the, we have the field, you know, and uh, we have really we're really good at home. And you know, I think getting out in playoffs will really help our chances at uh, moving forward. Gustavo was able to uh, get some minutes after spending some time off the field. Just overall, what's it like to be able to have him back on the field? It's great to have him back. You know, obviously he's a quality player. And I think as he gains fitness, he'll be another, another danger for other teams.